snow is slowly melting. In the valleys below, calving season begins early in Idaho. It starts in January, while the main season is from February through April. We are going to experience a little of what a rancher sees as we drive through the fields. Here's one getting ready. You see the water sack and a little hoof? A birth can happen quickly and can easily be missed. You can come back next time and wowee, there's a calf. It takes a lot of hay to feed this big family. Let's see, where is that big at? I know there's some breakfast around here somewhere. Notice her facial expressions as her entire body quivers preparing for the delivery. All mothers-to-be alter the state of their bodies temporarily with great suffering as they bring life into the world. She may be surrounded by the herd, but is very much alone in this sacred process. Did you see it come out? What did you think about that? It's kind of special, huh? That is a lot of bacon. This little piggy is coming out breech, which means backwards. This sow had most of her piglets breech. These little piglets are okay, but babies born breech could cause serious complications for larger animals or humans. It's recommended that you have a minimum of a 12 by 12 foot area for a full size mare to foal in. Football on no hands! <laughs> cows! 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 For a mile there are cows! Branding and doctoring is a spring activity in cattle operations. So the birth process is similar for all animals. On a rainy week in June, this cow elk is calving. Many calves are already born this late in the season. The calves look like Bambi or baby deer called fawns. The antlers are harvested and sold to China, who markets them for multiple purposes. Whoa. Goat's milk is easier to digest. It is used especially for babies that cannot take regular milk. Hospitals also use goat's milk. This is a domestic emu ranch. Did someone leave an avocado here? No, it's an emu egg. Watch, you want to? 